Okay, so I have a few ideas. Um, so my word is tomorrow. Um, a location, a forest of voices. And I had like a, a scenario of a friend's phone is found in a stranger's house. Which one do you want to? Do you guys want to discuss? Wait, are those three I different know. points? They're just yeah, three. Or, or, or I could, I, I don't know if there's any way you, I could <laughs> put them in, in as one. But what was the first one? Uh, tomorrow is the word. And what's this? Is do, them all, do them all again. I'll come up. So with the time. word is tomorrow. The location is Forest of Voices, and the scenario is a friend's phone found at a stranger's house. Okay. So you could do, um, like starting with a flashback, like her waking up in a, the Forest of Voices, okay. and it being like tomorrow, and then it. You cuts don't have back. to merge them all. It can just be. It yeah, can no, just I be just, I'm just gonna try and merge them all. Okay. Okay. I'll accept that. They wake up yeah. in the Forest of Voices. Okay. Then it cuts back to yesterday's because the first bit was obviously like tomorrow. Yeah. Then it cuts back to yesterday where there's this like argument or something. And okay. then this girl came home, she got like killed and her phone got stolen. And it was actually her friend's brother. Okay. Interesting. Yeah. I really like that one. Yeah. Do you know what you're doing? Not at all, yeah. I don't know what I'm going to like. Give us a word. Tomorrow? Yeah, tomorrow. Yesterday, today, present, past, future. Yeah, when I chose tomorrow, I was thinking... I was thinking some sort of, um, like, short film that sort of plays with the mind. So sort of maybe, like, a time loop or something like that. I don't know. Yeah, and Forest of Voices, when I initially thought of that, I was like, ghosts. And then some sort of murder with the phone's house. Yes. The friend's phone at someone else's house. So yeah. if that helps. I think when I when you say forest of voices, that makes me think of like people having voices in their head. That's literally yeah. what I was thinking. I was thinking that's okay. funnier. Having the voices inside their head about tomorrow basically. And then, you know, kind of saying, pretty much what would happen, like you said, of your friends finding a phone in a stranger's house and trying to warn what eventually does happen the next day, okay. more or less. Yeah, nice. Anything for tomorrow? Time travel. Yeah. Dementia. That's quite ideally. I was actually going to say that, so I actually think that's quite a good idea. Luke. I don't know that you could just keep playing with like flash forwards and flashbacks. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Does anyone see Memento? Nope. No. Oh, Would you film. like to? It's basically a film about this guy who's got dementia, I think, and he like. He, it, the film goes backwards, so it starts at the latest point of the film, sort of, and then goes backwards in events, and he's got dementia, so he forgets stuff. So yeah. Okay. Know, was that a suggestion, or was that just you? I'm just saying that's that form, that's kind of style is okay. unique. Yeah. All right. Thank you guys. No